I apologize. It's because of my excitement with the uh, the comedy. But let let's start um, earlier on. So you, we do have a lot of people uh, that have been on the show, as you know, and that listen to the show for business type of things. So uh, you know, twelve a, a dozen companies is pretty insane. So what were you doing before? What was your first company actually? Let's start there. What were you doing before that? Like, how did your entrepreneurial path start? Well, thanks for asking, Tyler. I was. Uh, the product of a divorced family and was uh, uh, kind of pushed into working at the age of 15. In fact, I was allowed to get my driver's license early because I was uh, helping to support my family financially. And uh, by the age of 17, while just finishing high school, I started my first small construction company. Uh, the, the quick story was I was working as a night janitor at a motel cleaning floors and, and bathrooms and overnight. And I was hanging out in the bar. And again, I was 17, so I was underage. And I was kind of hiding from the boss. And I overheard these two guys talking about making money on the weekends by painting the lines and parking lots. It's called striping. And I go, well, crap, I could do that. So I went and did some research. I went around and talked to the owners of other striping companies, asked them how they got started, how do they charge? And I put together what uh, basically would be called a business plan, uh, but I didn't ever have any money. So I found a friend that had just come into a, a small amount of money and he used $500. We bought our first paint machine, but we needed to get from job to job. So we brought in another high school buddy that happened to own a van and the three of us formed a and Restripe. And that was my first company. It was, uh, we striped all the uh, McDonald's and Safeways in Northern California, we did a furniture chain. We did an airport. It was uh, pretty exciting for 17. 